here's my new gun that I got a Taurus um, G2C it's a 40 caliber haven't shot it yet um, people have mixed emotions on this some people love them I haven't you know I'm a Glock style fan because I have a shadow system. Trigger kind of sucks on this thing. To me, obviously. $260 gun versus a $680 gun. So what do you expect? So far I like it. It's a little different with this I'm not used to. Um, I like the sights. The only thing that it's a little, is you know when you're carrying it with these sights here, it's like they're a little round, but they're a little, a little sharp. You know, so if you go like use the bathroom or something, you're like, you know, your arm is going to kind of like hit that, like you know. If you hit it too hard, it probably definitely probably cut you. Um, yeah. But um, <clears throat> it was a cool gun. Um, I got it because it was you know two hundred sixty dollars. It's not that bad. Um, some people's budget a little less, a little more. Um, <clears throat> I got it. Mostly to try something different, you know, get something different that's not nothing but Glock style guns. And I want something a little bit smaller, a little different. Um, and a, f a bigger caliber. So I got this. Um, it fits pretty good in your hand. The only thing, another thing, is these. It does the tend to, for me, maybe I'm just how I grip it kind of kind of hurts a little you know it's a little aggressive um well yeah um let me get a mag <clears throat> here's a mag that yeah it's 10 rounds plus one It's pretty good. Um, my hands ain't too big, I guess. And it fits, fits pretty good. Um, yeah, but we'll get to shooting real soon. Um, it is. I don't know if it's just a gun or. You know, because I'm used to. You know, my shadow system where the slide is just like butter. This thing is like when you try to pull it, it's a little bit, has a little oomph. You know, you got to yank it a little because of the bullet, I guess. I don't like, see, see that? Like I'm pulling pretty hard. See, pulling pretty hard. Um... Or, you know, you really want to pull it, you know, you just, <sighs> yeah, it's a little stiff. <laughs> but then again, it is a new gun, has not been fired. It is a pain to get that 10th round in there. A pain. So, think about getting this gun, yeah, some people say they let their mag and stuff sit like this for like a week or two weeks and it was people were able to get their 10th round in there so something to look out for you got this um forgot the name of it but um like a round indicator to let you know there's one in the round you know safety i don't know if hold on. let's see if you can see that yeah this where the little red let you know there's one in the chamber. 
you know, put it on safety. Obviously, won't fire. Um, <clears throat> yeah. Oh, and with the safety up, you cannot pull the slide back. And until you take that safety off, and it comes out. All right, guys, about to start shooting. We got 10 in here because uh, it's so dang hard to put that 10th round in this baby. I'm not going to put one in the chamber and, uh, you know, 10, you know, 11, I guess. Then had to put that dang, that 10th one back in. So, no, I ain't putting 11 in here. We're going to shoot 10 and that's it. Ready? Let's go, people. Y'all ready for this? Wow. <laughs> Smell it. <clears throat> All right, so far already don't like about it already is these these things hurt like ow my pinky already this thing as a 4 caliber uh this thing does have a little bit more kick definitely hurts my pinky hold on let me see if i can show you I don't know if you can see this a little. We can feel like uh, it hurts. It's like it's grabbing my pinky. So it's cool gun. Um, let's shoot some more. So far, two first shots with this new gun I got. So far, so good. Um, now let's try to like little rapid fire it. You know, maybe like, um, which had two shots, you know, because, you know, in a self-defense situation, you know, they say, you know, around what, one, two, three seconds, you know, of a situation, it's over. So, what, one, two, three, four, five bullets maybe is, you could... You know the situation could be over you know so let's pop off two shots kind of like quickly but kind of try to make it a little accurately on this one i don't really have a target so you know i'm kind of like there's a thing right there you see you can see it it's just a little like a little pillow that we have just sitting there so that's what i'm kind of hitting at <laughs> so all right Let's get to it. Let's let's try to get it from y'all sights. Let's try to get these sights in. Ugh. There we go. Oh, we're not aiming at it. There we go. Ready? Wow. Still hurts my finger. guys so that was 10 shots um with this box um it's a uh, hundred and eighty grains hundred and eighty grains uh this is what I just have for you know practice but drop this mag out it's empty mag and i got some self-defense ammo um uh, 
I can't remember what box it was. Um, but this ammo is basically what law enforcement uses. Um, hollow points. So, we're going to try these to see if uh, this gun can cycle through this self-defense ammo. They're hollow points, obviously. Um, so yeah, because these are what I'll be carrying. And I want to make sure they're reliable before, like, I start fully carrying this gun. So. <clears throat> Ugh. Okay. Doesn't want to go in. There we go. Kind of had to beat it a little, I guess. I spun y'all around because, you know... It's not the best looking like this. I want you to look like this. <clears throat> so, self-defense ammo. We're going to rack one in. Ugh, a little stiff. Ugh. There we go. It's ready to fire. So, let's, let's shoot this baby. See if it will cycle through. That hurt my pinky. Ow. Right. I got, well, three left. And we're gonna see if those do anything. Oop. It's on safety. Oop. It's off safety. So look. Safety. This is one handed, all because of I just did this. One handed. Wow. I'm going to try with my left hand. Let's have a little bit of kick. Alright, one more. See if we can try to hit something with it. I missed. <laughs> Alright, well... <clears throat> That's the Taurus G2C 40 caliber. Not too bad. Um, I would say the only downfall I have with this gun so far is this. This is really aggressive. Unlike my shadow system, it's like there's more and less aggressive. Like... See here, on this side, it don't look like it's too bad, but when you pull that baby around here, it is like really aggressive. Really aggressive. Kind of hurts, it really hurts my dang thumb. Even though my thumb ain't really touching it, but like, you know, when it shoots and stuff, it, my pinky kind of like rolls up a little and hits it. Hurts a little. It hurts. So, well, yeah, it's... I haven't had an issue. That was just, what, 20 rounds right through that. 10 of the FMJs and 10 of the self-defense ammo that I have. Um, I forgot what name of it. Something core? Corn? Core or something? I don't know. It's a blue box. What law enforcement uses. So, yeah. Um, like and subscribe. Comment. Um yeah uh let me know if there's any other cheap guns you want me to test out um give like a review to um yeah uh, i want to try to find something more budget friendly that's reliable that really anybody can carry so like this one ain't too bad my girlfriend says it fits in her, in her hand great um compared to the gun she has now this one obviously it's a 40 caliber she wants something a little smaller than a nine millimeter so you know maybe look at getting her like a a 380 see if she likes it cheap gun small a little bit smaller than this one she wants one a little bit just a tad bit smaller and a 380 and see how 
see how she likes it um probably do a review on that whenever that i get it It'll be somewhat soon probably after fourth of july but yeah i don't know okay i don't know i like buying guns i may get one sooner never know i could get one i could get two tomorrow you know i really want to get a high point just because it's stupid and cheap but i want to get something that's reliable anybody can use to defend their life with not you know get it because it looks cool so yeah like and subscribe comment and let me know what y'all want to see next bye Thank mm -hmm. you.